what's going on guys, YouTube 518 here, and today I'm going to be doing a review of the Lego Star Wars Hoth Medical Chamber, and honestly this is a pretty cool set for uh, 255 pieces, it comes with three figures, and one with the med medical droid back here, which I'm not sure if you would count that as a figure, but the set didn't really count it because it didn't show it on the front of the box for the figures and yeah it's a pretty neat set but first before i get on with the set i'm going to show you all of these figures so this is the um hoth version of princess leia and she's a pretty neat figure i think this is the only version of leia i have i might have other leias somewhere might have the preview like the older version of Le of the Hoth Leia, but she has um like this front printing is pretty cool the torso. There's no arm printing, but it, it's all right. It's not that big of a deal. And so and on the back it, it has some patterns there with the tan lines, and I it kind of looks like a hood. But it probably isn't because she never wore a hood in the movie. And I believe that's supposed to show her rank in the rebel in the, for the rebellion. And she has small leg printing right here. And her hair, I, I think that's the type of hair she has in episode 5. Because, I mean, probably, uh, why, why in the world would Lego put this... Put this hair on her if she doesn't you know wear it in episode five and yeah she has a double-sided face here and this seems to be like a serious or like a frustrated face i guess it's kind of hard to tell um so she has a serious face like a frustrated face and a little smirk right there like a happy face and yeah, now let's move on to Luke Skywalker. The figure I'm going to show you guys is Luke Skywalker. After he was attacked by the Wampa, went out of the Wampa Cave, and then nearly froze to death in the snow. And, yeah, he, he has a little bruise on his eye right there. And he has a tube going down his chest. And I'll sh it, it might look weird right now but I'll show you what it's meant to be pretty soon and he's got a little vest a little vest on right here or something like buckles and some buckles right here I guess like underwear or something and he, he has like some more of the vest thing and not much going on in the back there's like a lot of detail for his body. It's pretty cool. And his hair, it's like a dirty blonde compared to the um, Tatooine Luke Skywalker. Which I will show you right here. Yeah, see? There's a pretty big difference in the hair. But I like, uh, I like this hair more than this one. It just looks more... Um, a movie accurate and this Luke I got in the land in the Luke's land speeder the most recent one which was for the like Rogue One waves the, the Rogue One sets um, and he has a double-sided face he has a double-sided face right here which is where he has the tube going up in that mask, and he's asleep in the Bacta tank. Yeah, Bacta tank, or the medical chamber. And it's I think the medical chamber is like a pretty big part in the set, like the biggest part, because it's called the medical chamber. And and now I'm gonna show you um the medical droid. Last but not least, it's probably my maybe my favorite figure in the set. It's the medical droid, and I'm pretty sure he has a name on the box, which I don't have at the moment. And it's like I 
B something, I don't really know. And he, this is a pretty cool figure. He has the basic droid arms and droid legs. And his eyes, it looks like there's like three, cir three yellow circles put together, which looks really cool. I love that combination, I like that combination. And he has this weird thing right here. And I'm not sure what that's meant to be, but he has with his mouth. It, it's pretty cool what they did with the mouth. It, it's really detailed. It's like a, it looks like a microphone. And then it goes down into his chest and then up into his body. And there's not much going on in the back. But it's really weird what Lego does with these random holes through the droids. And he has like this cool neck printing right here. But yeah, all in all, this is, pretty, this is a pretty cool figure. And obviously, he doesn't have back printing. <laughs> he doesn't have a, a double sided face. It'd be weird if Lego did that. And yeah, this is a pretty, these are all pretty cool figures. So now, what you've been waiting for, the Lego set. Let's get on to it right now. So this is the medical chamber set, like the actual set, and so what I'm going to do is start from this side and make my way over to this side, but this is, like a, this is a pretty neat set, and it's got a lot of features, and yeah, so I'm going to start over here. Okay, so this is at the outside of the back to tank room, or the medical chamber room, and it actually has quite a bit of stuff going on here, like right here there's some medical needles that you can hang on the wall, there's a green medical needle, and a, like a baby blue medical needle, and in the drawers, like, they have, like, two sets of drawers. Like, there is nothing in here. There's nothing in this one. But in this one, there are there are some scissors, which you can give to, like, the, um, maybe one of the medical droids. And it comes with two pairs of scissors, too. It's pretty cool. So, two pairs of green medical um, needles and two pairs of blue medical needles and then right here there's a chair where you can put Luke on like like so like he's I guess you can have him like where he's sleeping with the mask on but I'm just gonna have him awake like maybe right here he's talking to Leia like this I just haven't turned his head yet and then, get them out of the way, you can put the medical droid right here, like on the control panel, which I, so far, what I can remember, um, this control panel only come, I, I've seen this control panel in the Resistance Bomber, which I have done a, a Lego review on that a while ago, like a some some months ago and right here there's some there's like a blue and red transparent lights and like a little air vent or something right there and right here there's a cabinet which doesn't have anything in it i think it's just there to take up space and not look so blank right here and there's a window that looks into the um the medical chamber room but right now I, I took it off so it wouldn't take so much take up so much room and now I'm just gonna turn this around just so for the sake of time and right here there's like a coffee cup a clear mug and like a, a bottle which I assume these are meant to represent medicine and there's a little sink with a faucet, which is a pretty cool, a pretty cool um, thing to add. Right here, there's 
I'm pretty sure these are the scissors. Yep, these are the scissors. The second pair. And I think this is the other needle. Yep, there's a needle. And right here, I really love this feature. Or it's not really a feature, it's just an add-on. It's like these pipes right here. This is a, again, take up room so it doesn't look so plain. And there's a little compartment, or like a cabinet right here. And then again, there's the window. And right here, it, this is like a weird um, thing to add. I'm not really sure why Lego did it, but it's so weird. It's, you can put Leia there, and she's standing literally right in front of the back of the tank. And I'll show you that li later. It's kind of weird. And right here, there's this little bed. And you could put, ah, you can put Luke right in there like you can s see these beds in a lot of Star Wars movies I, I really like how they added that and underneath there's some I suppose that's supposed to represent um lights right here yeah I'm pretty sure represent lights and yeah now let's go over to the actual bath to tank Part. And now this is like the main feature of the entire set because it's called um, the medical chamber, which I believe by medical chamber they made this thing, the back to tank. And this is like my favorite part of the set. And so over here it has like a control panel where the medical droid can stand and basically control or see what how Luke's doing in the back to tank. And I really love the idea of how they add the pipe right here. I'm not sure what this piece is called, but I, I like how they did that. And right here, this is the, um, I guess you can call it a medical droid. And there's another control panel right there, and this thing right here, it, it's meant to like extend its arm so it can like push the buttons and maybe like tap on the glass or something. And, and I think that's meant to be like, um, uh, like a little bit of Bacta, which is what, you know, the, it's what the, it, it's like a medicine in Star Wars. Like you just, I wish it was real so you can like be healed in like a matter of like a day. It, it, it doesn't really matter how serious it is. And right here, in order to get Luke in it, you, hang on, grab Luke, you can... Uh, and switch his face. You can pull this down, which is a really cool feature and idea, and just put him right in there. And pull him up, and it actually looks like he's inside. Well, I mean, he is inside the back of the tank. And yeah, it, it it's pretty realistic. Or, I mean, sort of realistic, like real. Um, Oh man, what's the word? I'm not really stumbling a lot of words. Ah, nah. Like movie accurate. Yes, that's the word. Um, or words. And you can pop this droid off, which I should have said before. And you can rotate around. So you've probably already seen. Again, I should have said that before. Not much going on in the back. And now I'm going to connect both pieces together, and then you can see what, how it looks so like. So this is what the set looks like, um, completely put together with all the minifigures in it. You kind of did see in the beginning of the video, but it looks pretty cool. And if you want it to be like one full room, which isn't really that big, just close that in, because you can see the hinges over the side, and it can be one full room but as you can see there's not that much room in there for figures to walk around the walls are completely built up which lego seems to do that a lot like being like just a play set but yeah this is basically it for the set and i hope you like subscribe hit that bell for notifications and join the notification squad and i'll see you all in the next video